video, I will show you exclusively how to calculate the horizontal range of a projectile. By a horizontal range, I mean the distance from where the projectile is launched to where it hits the ground again. The best definition of horizontal range is the maximum horizontal distance traveled by a projectile before it hits the ground. Let me say that again. It is the maximum horizontal distance traveled by a projectile before it hits the ground. The key word is horizontal. So X is generally given by V naught T cosine theta. The time of flight capital T is two times the time to reach maximum height, which is just two V naught sine theta all divided by G. So the horizontal range is equal to x max, which will be equal to v naught capital T cosine of theta. Therefore, r is equal to v naught capital T, which is v naught to v naught sine theta of a g multiplied by cosine of theta. This can be re-expressed as v naught squared 2 sine theta cosine theta all divided by g. But what do we know? We know that 2 sine theta cosine theta is just sine 2 theta. This is a trigonometric identity. Therefore, we can gladly see that the range R is V naught squared sine 2 theta all divided by G. One of the questions that is often asked is at what angle can you launch the projectile so that the horizontal range be at its maximum? And you can easily deduce that from trigonometry because the sine of 2 theta max is equal to 1 and this occurs when 2 theta is equal to pi over 2 therefore theta max is equal to pi over 4 so the angle which means that if you launch the projectile at an angle of 45 degrees or pi over 4 radians you will get R max at which point R max is just equal to V naught squared over G V naught squared over G